Riverdale police continue to investigate the tragic death of a two-year-old inside a Payless shoe source. It happened Friday night at a store off Highway 85 when police say a mounted mirror fell on the toddler. Mm. Here's the question tonight. Could this have been avoided? Chris Hopper's on the story with the latest. Chris. And Melissa, that's certainly the question that Riverdale police are trying to answer tonight. For now, they're calling it an accident, but their investigation will eventually give us an official answer. This Payless shoe source in Riverdale remains closed tonight. Someone who answered the phone today says he's not sure when it'll reopen. We also learned today two-year-old Ifra Sadiq's body has been returned to her family after a GBI autopsy. We're all still in a pretty big state of shock. Her family spoke to 11 Alive outside the store this weekend. They too want answers. The family says this mirror fell on Ifra. The family says you can see where it was in the store. Police say it hit her in the head. She later died at a local hospital. It was not secured at all. Uh, I think there was one screw that was put in. Police will not yet say if the mirror was somehow secured to a shelf or a wall. That is part of the investigation. Letitia called Patrick works next door. She saw Ifra on the ground and called 911. I'm just trying to figure out, you know, how could that happen in the store? Like, I don't know if it was it secure. 11 Alive reached back out to the Payless corporate office today, but have not gotten another response. In their latest statement from Saturday night, Payless says it is devastated by what happened and is working with authorities to understand it. And I've also asked the GBI for a cause of death. We're still waiting on that information. Of course, we'll continue to push for answers because we know so many people are interested in this story and what happened to this little girl tragically. Uh, I can't imagine what this family is going through, and I know it will yeah. stay in the story. Awful. Thank you, Chris. Mm -hmm.